More shipments of baby formula have arrived in the U.S., but the struggle now is getting the product onto local store shelves. Tonight, Help Me Hank is talking with local store owners who just are so frustrated as many of their customers are just waiting for formula. And despite promises of increased production and formula being flown in from overseas, it just isn't catching up with demand. Consumer investigator Hank Winchester has been in search of formula all day. What are you finding out there, Hank? And not much, Jason and Karen. I mean, here's the problem now. We have the formula in the U.S. Now there's supply chain issues, not enough drivers to get it here to pharmacies and places like Walgreens. Uh, we've been to CVS. We've been all over Metro Detroit, whether it's a big chain or a locally owned market or pharmacy. These business owners, they're frustrated, too. Help me hang cameras all over Metro Detroit today, and we're seeing the same thing play out in store after store. Very limited supplies of baby formula. Months into this crisis, it doesn't seem like things are getting any better. With the gas prices the way they are, and these people that are driving everywhere to try and find it, it's crippling for them. Andrew Brochard owns a market not far from Adrian. He's been working the phones, talking to suppliers. No luck. I'm at the mercy of my suppliers and you know they, they are doing everything they can to try and get product in on our on our shelves. It's just it, it, the production just isn't there. Here inside this local Kroger, take a look. There is some formula in stock, but there's also a lot of bare shelves. Whether it's here or different stores we visited, the one thing that can be very frustrating is we really can't find out when new shipments will arrive. And for local parents, it's a huge concern. I've talked to those of you who have been scammed online trying to buy formula. My heart dropped and I was like, we just lost the money. And others who've had to switch up what they're feeding their babies. Any formula that I see, and that's bad because my baby has acid reflux. Andrew's advice for those of you still searching. Keep calling. I mean, the best thing they can do is contact stores, ask when their shipments are coming in, uh, you know, to get approximate time that it might be on the shelf if they do get any. And that's really the only thing you can do right now. Try to form a relationship with the pharmacist, if it's a big name place, or the local store owner in your community. Try to find out when those trucks do arrive. That's the issue now. The product is here in the States. Production is ramping up. Now they just don't have enough people to drive the trucks to get the formula into your local community. I know, it is very frustrating. I'm Hank Winchester. Help me, Hank. Local 4, back to you. Yeah, and then just hope the truck is on time. Thanks, Hank.